just to let you know again. Yeah, we're going to start some sort of... um. Hey, hang on a minute. Is that the uh, box to my generator? Yes. To the one we put... I mean, left at my sister's place, yeah? Yes, yes. Okay. All right. Is there any manual? Are you sure there's no manual inside it? Are there any papers inside this box? Okay. All right. So anyway, yeah, we can have the chickens over here and we can have the uh, grass cutters over there. This is Samuel, my adopted brother anyway. There he is, Samuel from Plateau City. He know they speak outside, he know they speak, uh, he doesn't even speak good on their language. He's learning Igbo, we're getting there, you know. <clears throat> yeah, so, uh, Samuel, help me clear this up, whatever. Yeah, so uh, hopefully in a, in a few weeks time, we're gonna have this place full of grass cutters and stuff like that, but we obviously have to secure it so outside animals don't come in to come and eat the poor things. We might also do a little bit of work here because you notice that, you know, termites uh, have already gone to, gone to work uh, and so on. Chicken's a little bit nervous. We're not eating it, you know? Yeah, and this is the real, this is my rustic farm uh, and so on. So, uh, it, it needs to be looked after. I'm not in town. I need to just redo all of this. And uh, yeah. And so now we come out to the main living areas. We simply take it from there. Yep, these have had a lot of fish heads. These lovely doggies here. Bola, Nana. Cool. Yeah. yeah. So this is the dry season. So obviously the crops don't do very well. They've done the harvest. So, uh, you know, everything's very dry. But, um, you know. We're going back to the living quarters. Hello. Some. Okay, we've got some bird activity here. Those birds you see is what they call inyone. Let me see if I can zoom in on them. They're all taking off now as they see us. You see them? See them, they're all scarpering. They're all scarpering, proper scavengers they are. You know, let me show you the royal chicken. This was given to me by the king. You know, so I call this one a royal chicken. My sister said, let's eat it. You know what I mean? She goes to me, we are gonna eat it. I call it royal, <laughs> you know? So we'll come back to the main living quarter areas um, and stuff. There's an awful lot of work that's gotta be done down here. Most of the time when I come out here, I haven't come on a holiday. I've just come to scope the place. Still struggling to do the landscaping for a section in the front. Um, so we've got all our rest spots here. You know, it's nice to uh, go up a floor where you get a bit more breeze and a bit more wind in this hot area. One of the best spots is over there. I should zoom in on that. That's one of the best spots. You know, you can sit up there. That palm tree over there gives you a lovely canopy and so on. That's another lovely spot there. That's another lovely spot to chill out. But obviously I've got to do my ranch fencing all the way down beyond that point over there. Ranch fencing all the way down, you know, all the way down there and so on and so forth. You know, and then obviously ranch fencing on that side. Saw a couple of horses, lovely. 500 pound each, mum and calf, if it's called a calf or pony, whatever. Anyway, I'm gonna go up and talk business with this guy now. Um, and I'm signing off. Bye-bye.